Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm here with my dad today and we're getting ready for hay season. We're going to uh, do some work on the, the uh, Heston PT7 uh, hay bind today. Uh, last year I broke about six inches off the end of the sickle bar and uh, I hadn't been able to find one. Well, I have found some, but they're about, uh, I think it was about $200 plus shipping. So we're, uh, we're gonna see if we can take a New Holland sickle bar and cut the, the, the head off of it and uh, re-rivet the head off of this one onto that bar if they're the same length. If not, we may just cut a little bit of it off and weld it in or something, but uh, so yeah, that's what we're doing. We're gonna get this thing ready and uh, get it ready for hay season. I don't know if any of the other hay binds or sickle binds is made this way, but you see on the, the Heston's got two bolts on it right here. And then that's threaded through there. And then it's got a, uh, like a lug nut uh -huh. tapered that goes on the bottom right here and pulls it up. Keeps it from backing out, I guess. I ain't never seen nothing like that. You see the old Fords has got that ball and socket, right? Uh-huh. And then the uh the new Holland has the uh like the rubber bushing in it with a bolt through it. And uh the Massey Ferguson sickles are has got a uh a a tapered bolt that goes down in and you have to drive it out it's like a uh, ball joint oh, okay on a car right you put the, like tap, a, you have like to put a, the tap back on the end of it and hit it like a tie rod in yeah This one's seen better days. So that one's bent. I don't know if you can see it on camera. But when it gets right there. It arches up pretty bad. See it right here? Yeah. So the New Holland's got this extra hole right here. It looks like the knife back is the same length, this piece of metal here. But then when you get Even if you, so if you line these two up right here, it's got this extra hole, and then them two's not the same distance apart. And your, your knives ain't lined up. I don't know if these has got to hit the guards in the right spot. Right. They have to open up. Yeah, have to open right up. in the center.
Well guys, I think that's gonna about do it. Uh, we uh, made us a new sickle bar out of an old New Holland, uh, two old New Hollands actually, and then we took the uh, the headpiece off of the, the Heston sickle bar and just used it. So maybe it'll uh, hold together. We'll find out. Uh, Y'all stay tuned and, and we'll uh, make a video on this thing in action and see if, it, see if it's gonna hold together, so. Uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you hadn't already, go down and subscribe. We sure would appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.